Hello everyone, this is Prabhakaran. Hope you are doing good and fine. How to find or identify the fake or unsafe websites? When typing username and password or when doing online transaction, try to ask one question with you whether you are in the safe hand. More number of threats occur in the recent days due to two most common attacks in internet that is malware and phishing. Number one, the malware. The malware websites contain code that installs malicious software onto the visitor's computer either when a user thinks they are downloading legitimate software or without a user knowledge. Second is the phishing websites which pretend to be legitimate so that they can trick user into typing in their username and password or sharing their private information. These two attacks, malware and phishing attacks, play a vital role in the hacking environment. Now, how to safeguard from this particular attacks? Let's see that. Google has a fantastic technology that examines billions of URL in a day. That is Google Transparency Record. So, go to Google and type as a Google Transparency Report. Okay, and uh, click on Enter. You will redirect to the page Google transparency report so click on that scroll down and where you can see the google safe browsing okay so click on the google safe browsing safe browsing is a service that google security team built to identify the unsafe websites across the web and also it's notify the users every day this safe browsing detects thousands of new unsafe websites which end in an unwanted uh, malware activities. This unsafe website falls in two categories that is uh, malware and uh, phishing sites. You can see the detailed report uh, from this data set day wise and also year wise. Uh, and also it have a special option called uh, notify uh, webmaster and identify the webmaster. You can see here it will notify the webmaster whether the sites have been hacked and also it provide information to clean up that particular problem once if the hacking done over there now how to use this okay so click on the site status before performing private operations such as online transaction and uh, information sharing in any unknown or uh, unfamiliar website check whether the particular website is safe or not also whether it undergoes with any malware or phishing attacks okay now once you click on the site status you can see the check site status so now for the use of friendly familiarity i'm going down with one of the e-commerce website so flipkart yeah flipkart.com okay now i have to give enter so it will check for the status of the particular website yeah, here you can see the result that no unsafe content found and the recent update was on the june 7 2020 it will update till now about that particular website so do this process when you are doing transaction in any unknown or untrusted website to safeguard from uh, private information and bugs uh, uh, whenever you are doing any online transaction go down that particular check site status and type that particular website and check whether it is safe or not and finally end up with the safe transaction and prevent from the malware and phishing attacks okay yeah thank you so much for your patience listening do good be good stay connected with kit and visit alum for more interesting facts and related to science and technology thank you